What is Gliburide? How it can manage your diabetes? Welcome to today's video on Gliburide, an incredibly powerful and widely used medication that has transformed the lives of many individuals managing diabetes. If you or someone you know is dealing with diabetes, understanding the ins and outs of Gliburide can be the key to gaining control over blood sugar levels and leading a healthier life. In this video, we will discuss its classification, indications, suggested doses, administration guidelines, potential adverse effects, drug interactions, and most importantly, its remarkable effectiveness in lowering blood glucose levels. What is Gliburide? It's an oral anti-diabetic medication that falls under the class of drugs known as sulfonylureas. As we mentioned earlier, Gliburide is a true game-changer when it comes to managing type 2 diabetes mellitus. It works in an extraordinary way to help regulate blood sugar levels. Indications for Gliburide Gliburide is a powerful tool specifically indicated for patients diagnosed with type 2 diabetes mellitus. When lifestyle modifications such as diet and exercise do not effectively control blood sugar levels, gliburide steps in as a crucial adjunct therapy. Its primary mechanism of action involves stimulating the pancreas to produce more insulin, thereby lowering blood glucose levels. The ability of gliburide to enhance insulin production makes it an invaluable option for individuals who require additional support in managing their diabetes. By adding gliburide to their treatment regimen, patients can experience improved blood sugar control and a better quality of life. Doses and Administration For most individuals, the initial dose of gliburide prescribed by healthcare providers ranges from 2.5 mg to 5 mg, taken orally once daily. It's important to note that the exact dosage may vary depending on individual response, severity of diabetes, and other factors determined by your healthcare provider. Throughout your treatment, your healthcare provider will closely monitor your blood sugar levels and may make adjustments to the dose if necessary. However, it is crucial to adhere to your healthcare provider's instructions and not make any changes to your dosage without their guidance. While individual needs may differ, it's essential to be aware that the maximum recommended daily dose of gliburide generally does not exceed 20 mg. By carefully following the prescribed dosage and administration guidelines, you can maximize the benefits of gliburide in managing your diabetes effectively. Starting Gliburide and Dose Adjustments When initiating treatment with gliburide, healthcare providers typically start with a low dose. This approach allows the body to adapt gradually and reduces the risk of potential side effects. Starting at a lower dose also enables healthcare providers to assess individual response and make necessary adjustments to achieve optimal blood glucose control. During your treatment journey, it is essential to have regular follow-up appointments with your healthcare provider. Based on the results of these monitoring sessions, your healthcare provider may recommend adjustments to the gliburide dosage. Timing and Frequency to ensure the effectiveness of gliburide and maintain consistent blood glucose levels, it is typically taken once daily. You have the flexibility to take gliburide with or without food, depending on your preference and tolerance. However, it is crucial to establish a routine and take gliburide at the same time each day. This consistency helps maintain a steady level of medication in your system and promotes stable blood glucose control. By adhering to a regular dosing schedule, you can optimize the benefits of gliburide and support your diabetes management efforts. Adverse Effects As with any medication, gliburide can potentially cause adverse effects in some individuals. It is essential to be aware of these possible side effects. Common side effects of gliburide may include hypoglycemia, low blood sugar, gastrointestinal upset, such as nausea, stomach discomfort, weight gain, and skin reactions, like rash or itching. These may include severe allergic reactions or hematologic disorders, such as abnormal blood cell counts. Drug Interactions When taking gliburide, it is crucial to be aware of potential drug interactions that could affect its effectiveness or increase the risk of side effects. Gliburide can interact with various medications, including certain antibiotics, antifungal drugs, and blood thinners, among others. For example, certain antibiotics like sulfonamides or fluoroquinolones, Antifungal drugs such as fluconazole or ketoconazole, and blood thinners like warfarin can interact with gliburide and alter its metabolism or enhance its effects. Gliburide's Effects on Blood Glucose Levels Gliburide helps lower fasting blood glucose levels as well as blood glucose levels after meals, random blood glucose. 
The extent of reduction varies among individuals and may depend on factors such as diet, exercise, and the severity of diabetes. Typical reduction in blood glucose levels. Fasting blood glucose, 10 to 20 percent. Random blood glucose, 15 to 25 percent. A1C, 1 to 2 percent. Conclusion. Gliburide is an important medication for the management of type 2 diabetes. It belongs to the class of sulfonylureas and is used when lifestyle modifications alone are not sufficient. Consult your healthcare provider for personalized advice regarding dosing, administration, potential adverse effects, and drug interactions. Remember to follow your healthcare provider's instructions and monitor your blood sugar levels regularly for optimal control. Thanks for watching. Do subscribe our channel for staying updated on diabetes management.